Hey card makers, this is Trisha Morris at Club Scrap with a sneak peek at the Fairy Tale card kit released in August of 2021. As always, we've sourced some beautiful ribbons here. I have a taffeta edged pink. We've got this gorgeous, really super soft lavender, as well as a sparkly gross grain um, blue. And then for the rest of the goodies, we are featuring these adorable glittery mini puffy stars as well as some really sweet tiara charms for all the princesses in your life and then there's also a series of these beautiful laser cut frames and um, these make gorgeous almost like a storybook style frame for our cards now for the paper and i'm really excited about this month's paper collection we've got this beautiful all over print it's very simple and um it's got some nice gradient of color in the background. For the pink, and I know some of you find pink to be rather polarizing, but we just could not resist this stunning pink paper. I'm not, not sure if you can hear the texture of this. It's just absolutely beautiful. It has a, a sparkly sheen to it, and it does have this beautiful texture as well. And the plain side is more smooth, but this uh, front side is absolutely beautiful. So if you're a bride looking uh, to make some handmade wedding invitations and this is your color, definitely grab some of this beautiful paper. Then we have this uh, really just pretty aqua color. And then if you look here, we have um, this stunning lavender and blue. But here's something super cool about this paper. When I turn it over, do you see what happened? This is a duplex. So it's actually a piece of laminated cardstock. So it's super heavy, heavy weight. It's a purple on one side and then blue on the other. Super cool. Finally, we have the cut aparts as well here. We have two sheets and um, some really fun quotes. Don't let the muggles get you down. Um, Let's see, we're like the same person, only you're older and so on. There's some really fun things in here. Great for birthdays of all ages, actually. And I know sometimes I lack the birthday cards I need for younger girls and boys. And I think we've got this, your base is covered here with this kit. So, of course, with all of our card kits, you'll get the instructions and... I'm particularly fond of these instructions because of the formulas that I have. You only have one, two, three cutting diagrams to make all 12 cards. And then several of them are cut from several sheets of paper. But what I like about this is it's very replicatable. And a lot of these are sort of standalone formulas. Super neat for you to um, complete these first. And then you can make more cards from your, with papers from your stash using these formulas. And all the pictures of the cards will be in here. And then, um, as always, I'm going to be doing a video. So the finished card include this double Z fold style and we even have some fussy cut images that that attach between this larger sentiment here on the strip and add a lot of dimension and then finish with those adorable little puffy stars. I think any anyone would love to get um, this really beautiful card and you can see that duplex paper at work here in the background you've got the purple on one side and the blue on the other so you can flip flop these any way you wish depending if you have a, a color that you prefer. I love this one, Metal Knot and the Affairs of Dragons, for you are crunchy and taste good with ketchup. And here's another fun one. I love how this castle, just a little fussy cut work here, looks on this one. Then for the A6 cards, and by the way, all of these kits come with envelopes. For this size card, we have some fun, uh, it's, like a, it's a gatefold flap with, with some very useful sentiments. And occasionally I like to throw in, in a anniversary or a wedding card. This could be used for both. And then this one can be used for an anniversary. Finally, in the A7 sizes, um, I did take an embossing texture folder and added texture to the panels. And again, what's neat about these is that you could do the purple on the outside and the blue or flip these any way you wish, depending on which uh, color you prefer, or to create more contrast between the sheets of paper. So that duplex is going to come in really handy. We have two vertical and then two horizontal cards in this style. So I'm looking forward to seeing you in this fairy retail card workshop. I will walk you through the trimming and assembly of all 12 of these cards with you in class. So I will see you there. Don't forget to take a look at the fairy tale page kit as well. Thanks for joining me.